Welcome to Canada! Hi, my name is Megan. Join me as we explore new places together, hike some trails, and enjoy this adventure outdoors. Last night we crossed the border over to Canada, and this morning we are enjoying a beautiful sunrise here at Niagara Falls before heading on to Toronto to spend three days exploring the city. Tell me this sign does not mean no DJ. Look at these squirrels. Sunrise at the falls was incredible. As you probably just saw, we're heading back to our hotel now. It's about a mile and a half and we're gonna grab some breakfast and then hit the road toward Toronto. I think we have one or two hikes, uh, waterfall hikes we wanna stop and do along the way. So let's go. So we've driven about 30 minutes and we're just outside of Hamilton, Ontario and we're hiking on the Mountain Brow side trail. It's about a two and a half mile loop. Uh, a bit of it follows the road so it's super easy to find parking and it features two waterfalls that we're hoping to see. Just so we know we came to it, Buttermilk Falls. Honestly, this red tree is probably more scenic. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Follow the blazes. Actually, this is kind of nice. Yeah. Like, actually tells you what the blazes are. Tuxedo wise? Has a... We love a little road walk. <laughs> yeah, those are pretty. guy just landed on me. According to my chorus, we're back at the car in 2.38 miles and heading to possibly somewhere to get poutine. Sorry. 
made it here to Toronto. Just got to our Airbnb and we have managed to snag Leafs tickets for the game tonight. So we have about an hour to get ready before our Uber gets here. So Taylor's in the shower, I'm gonna hop in the shower and then we're gonna get changed and head downtown to the arena. walked over here to a bus stop where we're waiting on the 12C line to take us down to Scarborough Bluffs Park and we're going to do some hiking over there today. It's really nice just to hang out on the beach for a while and we're heading to one more viewpoint of the cliffs before we catch a bus back to our Airbnb. I think tonight we're gonna stay in and make some pasta and then tomorrow uh, it's looking like the weather's a little questionable so we may or may not head downtown and explore the city a bit. We ended up doing about five and a half miles and now we are waiting for our bus to go back to our Airbnb. Good morning. Today is our second full day here in Toronto. We are making our way to the bus station to head downtown to explore some places like Kensington Market, go and try to find some of the Banksies, and yeah, I'll take you along for what we get up to for a full day in downtown Toronto. We're just taking some time and walking the streets here in Kensington Market. Lots of cute little shops. We are heading towards a Thai restaurant that we want to check out for lunch as well. Um, there are children here on like a field trip <laughs> doing a scavenger hunt, which that's kind of fun. Morton's on the corner and because we're in Canada we have to even though I've got mixed reviews we're gonna pop in there and maybe get an apple fritter and try to get some hockey playing cards that people have been telling us about and I might try one of their coffees. Oh, 
about to open up our um, trading cards that we got. Okay. There I go. <laughs> It won't focus on the like. Let's, oh, there we go. <laughs> All right, I think we gotta try. I got the um, apple fritter, which was recommended by everyone on Threads, and the coffee, which was not recommended by anyone on Threads. <laughs> It's giving Duncan. Duncan. Yeah. <laughs> the London fog is good. Oh, the fog war. Don't you need that? Oh, you would see fog boy. It's like English. We are making our way to lunch, but we just got stopped. <laughs> For the second time today, someone commenting on us looking like sisters, but she asked us if we were twins. <laughs> Comment down below if you think we look like sisters or twins. <laughs> Right, it's been a second since we checked in with you guys, but we went over to the well, got some things at Indigo, went book shopping, and then we headed over to home of the Toronto Film Festival, uh, which is known around the world. We're walking down King Street now on our way to go and get a famous Canadian dish. Can you guess what we are going to get? <laughs> for the chicken bacon ranch. It was good. Sure, you can hear me over the winds, but if you can, we're down here at the yacht rentals, and that's not what we're getting on. We're gonna try to get some tickets to the ferry, water taxi, to make it over across to the island before sunset. Again, not sure if we're gonna be able to see sunset, but at least we'll get a nice city skyline view. We saw a Banksy on our way over here, so yeah, I'll bring you guys along for the very ticket buying process if we can figure out where to get tickets. All right, so in winter time, the ferry only runs to Wards Island every 30 minutes here from the Jack Layton Ferry Terminal. 
We're gonna go up and buy our tickets. Should be about $9 round trip. It is 8.45 and we just made it back to our Airbnb. It was a bit difficult to chat with you guys on the ferry, but we took the 6 p.m. ferry across to Ward's Islands and it was so, so beautiful. Highly recommend. Uh, we did a little sunset cruise. We weren't sure what the weather was going to be like because it had been cloudy all day, but it ended up being absolutely beautiful. I believe the winter schedule starts on October 15th, which means that it only goes over to wards but we are going to be heading back across the border tomorrow morning into the u.s so this is it for our canadian adventures thank you guys so much for coming along the past few days you know what to do if you like this video give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to stick around for future adventures and ring that bell so that you never miss a video i will see you guys in the next adventure